So here we are, it's late June, and we have baby cashmere goats lined up to join the homestead. But before we can bring them home, we have a couple things we need to do first. Number one, we have to make some space for hay storage, which means clearing out this old barn. That's not very nice, is it? The question is, what if I knock this down and then this falls on me? Well, I see that it's connected to that board. Yeah. Yeah, that's not as fun, but we'll try it. Oh, we got it. I got it. Yeah! We still have a lot of work to do in here, but for now it'll do. The second thing we need to do before we can bring the goats home is build a fence. It's level. <laughs> I don't know how I did it, Ella, but it's level. We got a gate. Look. 
it's going to open this one. But, see? It's very gaty. it in the hole first. There you go. And then, yep, just like that. And then while they're like that, pull it out. Hey, it's level. Why don't you stick the level down in the hole and see how deep we are? What? Come on. We're so Yes. Hold it tight. So I got a little impatient and decided to bring home a couple Nigerian dwarf dolings before our fence was done. So we set them up right in our backyard with an electric poultry net and a large kennel with a tarp for shelter until we could move them to the barn. And it worked out pretty well actually. We are up late at night, the girls have gone to bed and we are trying to prep the barn which you can barely see right now, for the goats to come tomorrow. We're gonna put up a hay feeder thing, some water buckets. We spread some lime on the floor. We're gonna put straw down. I will try to get a better shot of it in the morning. This is sort of the shop area. Still very much <laughs> in the process of repairing and fixing. We took down all the drywall. It's the new cedar planks that Matt put up. We've reframed it. This is where we have our water pump for the well. It needs to be enclosed. Just opened up this door. Need to build a sliding door. And this is, <laughs> sorry, the door down. To where the goats will be. We're gonna milk up here probably and we're gonna try to make it really nice eventually <laughs> but for now yeah. <laughs> a different kind of straw, I guess. You just set up your little buildings and then you run <laughs> them. <laughs> <laughs> Not so much working for you. <laughs> He's got some pent up rage or something. <laughs> it's been a long day. This is celebration. <laughs> Nature's confetti. <laughs> Diagonal. 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 Yeah. Uh -huh. Wow, she's getting on it. If you please, 
So after we got a fence up, we were able to put our two Nigerian dwarves in the goat barn and we took the kennel that they had been using and plopped it in the back of a pickup truck so we could go and get the cashmere goats. <laughs> Hello, welcome home. This is Martin. Like He's the baby. He still drinks milk. This is Fern. And then these two are the weathers. And this one is our on the far end. She's our cashmere cross dough. They're working out their pecking order stuff. So we've got a little feeder over here. We're gonna put up another feeder over there. And we're still working out some kinks. I still have not seen a goat drink any water, so we might need to move those. And we're gonna get our minerals and our baking soda out. Right up here. Right away. So we ended up lowering the buckets a little bit. And now we have water drinkers. just have a very small area fenced off for them right now because that's all that time would allow but we are planning to fence off this whole pasture out here as soon as possible because look 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 at all that food finally got the fence secure enough that we feel like we can let them out and Matt is working on the electric line right now and they're so happy. That means I'm done. <laughs> so these three right here, this one, this one, and this one are siblings. Those two runners are Nigerian dwarf half sisters. And then that one in the middle that's going towards Matt is the loner. And I freaking love this goat. He's so cute. So we got three well girls, done. three boys. And the cashmere's are so soft. What you doing, Martin? <laughs> <laughs>